So recently I've been noticing that girls are having a hard time finding boyfriends because boys are looking for the most attractive females ever. I've also noticed sort of a repeating pattern with what most boys are interested in. So today I'm going to be showing you how to do your makeup to find a boy who is extremely attractive to you. <clears throat> First we're going to take the darkest foundation you have. Mine is more of an orange color but that's okay too. If you have orange then go for it. So pretty much what you want to do is you don't want to go all out with it and you just want to dab it uh, so it doesn't turn you too dark but you're not too light at the same time because if you're too dark then most boys won't want you because for some reason some boys like to make fun of darker females and then some boys are actually very attracted to them and it's weird it's just really confusing so you're just gonna wanna dab this all over wherever you can find a space for so like you can't miss anywhere because then they'll know that it's a fake and you do not want that because if they know that it's fake then they'll think that you're fake and that is not what you are out to look for you're out to try to find somebody who thinks you are being the a hundred percent real you so you want to try to pull it off as well as you possibly can so if you can do that then I'm sure you won't have a problem so you just want to get that you get your face nice and orange I'm not sure if you can see me well um if you know somebody who has a darker skin tone than you you might want I recommend asking them if you can borrow their uh, cover up if they use any if not go out to the store and if the um, if the uh, cashier asks you which I'm not sure why they would because it's your personal business and not theirs um, if they ask you why you are getting a shade ten times darker than your own skin tell them that it's for a friend so now that you have your cover up applied you have to take a very a white color and you're gonna want to apply the white color to the eyelid um, mine isn't as white anymore because yesterday it got used up the wrong way and but so you'll want to take that white color and apply it to the eyelid don't forget to get it way way up so it's more it stands out more uh, po possibly all the way up to the eyebrow would be good. Um, you'll just want to get that all over the eyelid. Um, now, this is only recommending white. There's oh, many different other colors that you could use if you choose to use those colors but if not then you can always just use white okay so now that we have all that in you want to take the um a darker like a almost brown color like a that and you'll want to just dab it on your face it'll like cover up the orange color and um just it'll make you seem a little bit more darker than you really are because that's just how people like it I don't know why but it's just a trend with people I suppose you could say so now that you have the brown 
on your face. But can you see like that? Now that you have the brown on your face, you gotta take your eyeliner and you'll want to kind of like get sort of a wing going on in your eyeliner. If you don't know what that means, then I can show you. So pretty much just take the top of your eyelid and color a large thick line and then bring it out in a wing at the side and then you'll want to make sure you get the bottom eyeliner on you'll want to make it thick though because guys like thick eyeliner I don't know like that do the same for the other side and make sure that it's nice and thick because if it's not thick then it might not work so like that and then after that you'll want to take of course you want to do the mascara like so and now that you've done that you'll want to take this uh, a pinker color maybe even plum like this one and you'll just want to use that and you'll want to apply it as blush to the cheek and make sure you get it nice and out like outward to expand the cheekbone to make you look like you have a nice and long cheekbone and if you want to add other pinker colors with the purple then that can always work too because it'll make you have a very nice fine pink color in your cheek um, then after that you're going to want to take the brush I've noticed that guys tend to like girls who look more mature sort of so you'll want to take a nice black uh, eyeshadow and just trace your brow line with it and it is okay if your brows look a little bit more thicker than normal um, I noticed that's a nice trending thing too and uh, and you'll just want to take that and then drag it across your uh, like to connect your brow both of them together you'll want to drag it across the face like that to make it nice and nice and interesting and um, at the tips of them if they don't look like they're long enough just take them and pull them out a little like that don't and if you do it to one side then you have to do it to the other so they don't look uneven and weird like that and then you're going to want to take the same black and then just kind of trace a little a little mustache looking thing because it just gives you a more interesting look it helps guys notice that you're different from the crowd you know so do that and then last but not least take a nice fine pink color for the lips and you want to take that color and just put it on your lips around and maybe if you choose make your lips a little bigger than they really are cause that uh, no, a more plump lip could help a man think hey maybe she's a nice woman and then they'll want to talk to you you know so just make your lips nice and plump and beautiful see my lips look plump and nice and um and don't forget to get them you know 
big and since you have the nice mustache here have them touch the mustache because that could enhance your chances um so this is pretty much a nice trend that I've seen um if you take this look into account I'm sure you could find a man who is more than willing to love you now your only job is to find out how you want to do your hair now also if you want to have guys more attracted you might want to have sort of a New Jersey accent because a lot of guys out there are attracted to Snooki and if you act like you are Snooki then that's how you can get some men so thank you for watching and I hope that this look gets you some nice looking guys bye bye